The Action Pad is the perfect solution for end users to control a lighting and media installation easily from a touchscreen. To go into full screen mode, just double click onto the top frame. If you click onto the edit mode, you can also edit the background picture by simply just double clicking onto the background. Inside the Action Pad properties, you can change the properties for one page or for all pages. It's also possible to change the name, the group name and the scripting ID. And you can choose which macro should be executed once you leave or enter a certain page. The two background colors can be used to make a color spread on the background. So just choose two colors and a new color spread on the background will be generated. Going back to the properties menu with a double click, one more option is to use a picture instead of a color spread as a background. Just choose a picture and then you can choose the picture align mode. So you can fit it onto a complete page with different options or you can put it in any corner of the action pad. As the EQ logo has a completely white background, I will change both colors to white to make it fit to the logo. Some more properties inside of the action pad properties is to enable the taskbar and main menu link for this page. Inside of the all pages tab, you can enable or disable the taskbar in the bottom left and choose the colors for it. You can also completely disable the menu and one great feature is to set a screen frame. So whenever you have to prepare an action pad for a touchscreen that has a certain resolution which is different to your setup screen right now, you can change it to the desired resolution and you will have an orientation frame to make sure that the action pad you are creating will fit onto the screen later on. The main menu on the bottom left corner allows you to log out to protect the system with a password. You can view the status, logbooks or the automation as well as the DMX output and do a quick network setup. You can also set the touchscreen to a full screen mode which is called kiosk mode. The kiosk mode is kind of the end user safe mode. You can leave the kiosk mode with Alt, Shift and K or just click the button in the menu.